this year and uh, just hasn't worked out for me. Yeah. Let's go, dude. New PB. <laughs> Helps if I have a microphone on. How's it going? Goodness gracious. I'm so excited for this. Um, camera's looking fantastic, but we got our first fishing trip of the year figured out everyone. And, uh, it's going to be, like I said, it's going to be, here we go. Let's try to do this. Going to be on the modern day outdoorsman, uh, YouTube channel, the full video. Anyway, I'll make sure to put a trailer of it on the BZ hub as well. Uh, but yeah, this is going to be our, uh, like I had mentioned before, it's going to be kind of our outdoors place. Any sort of uh, fishing, uh, hunting, outdoors related stuff is going to be on the modern day outdoorsman. So that is, uh, yeah, that's that's the truth, everyone. It's going to be it's going to be fun. I'm, I'm excited for the future, but uh, I'm seeing things for uh, fishing sim first fishing sim world pro tour first. That's uh that's against what we usually do though. Usually we start out with hunting and then we go into and then we go into other stuff afterwards. Not today though, or we wanted to mix it up. Is that what I'm hearing? We gotta here. I gotta get I gotta get some sort of <clears throat> some sort of music going. Alright, top notch. Well, uh, what do you what do you all think? Huh? Should we start out with fishing first? It'd be a first. We've never done that before
Piano music. Fishing first. Glazy is all about the fishing. We got one for fishing and one for hunting at the moment. So I'm, I'm waiting for a tiebreaker. Levi's saying fishing first. Call of the wild first. Fishing. Yeah, fishing. All right. All right. All right. All right. We're going to do fishing first then. You're throwing me off. Okay. Goodness gracious. Well, if we're going to go on the fishing sim, then I've got to turn this music off because fishing sim needs no, no music to start out. I, I don't know about you guys, but I love this. Uh, I love this song. Get it going. Get it going. Go fishing sim world. We're all waiting on you. There we go. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, dude, is this is this song not pumping it up? I tell you what, if you guys haven't tried this game, it's fantastic. They got so much stuff in it. Not so much. I mean, it's not like Fishing Planet amount of stuff, but it's still a fun game. But we are in the rock and open today, everyone. Fishing Predators. Uh, so let's just get into it. Boy, we have Predators, Carp, Predators, Carp again. Where's the bass fishing tournaments? <laughs> anyway. Um, I do have a pretty good um, setup. That Pro Shad Lure freaking wrecks. So uh, hopefully... We find some good weedy areas and can get some get some pike out of there or something like that. <laughs> Can't wait for tomorrow. Whitetails will be fixed. Hopefully be able to find new zones. Ooh, that'll be fun. I haven't I haven't hunted for the, the whitetail at all. So let's see. Where's a shallow area? Looking for shallowness. I'm going to go into that little cove over there. When's Call of the Wild? Call of the Wild's gonna be at the halfway point. So if you're if you're fairly new to this whole thing, Mondays are half and half Mondays. We do half hunting, half fishing, usually. Uh, but today we're starting it off with uh, fishing. As competitors are getting ready for the start of this exciting event. While we wait for the action to begin, let's take a look at the rules for today's tournament. There we go. Amateur predators here. Total length. Oh, we're going off total length. We better go after some pike then because those things are freaking long. BZ Hub in the lead. Op wow, it's it's like nighttime. All right, all right, all right, all right. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, and we're going... Going this way. Go, boat, go. I have a feeling. I saw this spot on the map. I have a feeling about it. We're going to find Mondo fish there. Should you buy the Bass Boat Explorer pack? Only if you want to. I, you know, I don't recommend buying any of the DLC packs. Um, I always say to just play the game. Um, you know, you can earn DLC packs playing tournaments and stuff like that. So if you, if you truly want some of the DLCs, you know, uh, wait for a tournament to come out and, and, you know, test your metal. Uh, Henry Garabalar, one of the guys uh, who watches us play Fishing Planet and whatnot, uh, part of the community, is really good at Fishing Planet. And uh, he always wins all sorts of DLCs. We are going to go back into this cove over here. I have a feeling about it. I saw it on the map and I thought, that's where I'm going. What's up, BZ? I got my first baitcaster. Hey, right on, Edon. Hopefully, it's going to be sweet, man. What the frick? Evidently, it got very shallow. 
That or we hit a wall. <laughs> this going on. Maybe it would be helpful to see a depth gauge or something on the boat, huh? Just ideas. Just throwing out ideas, man. Goodness gracious, what is the deal? Just let me drive. It must be very shallow in here. It's like nighttime, it's hard to see. Here we go, this is exactly what I was looking for. Can we switch to fishing now? Goodness gracious. All right, big fish. We can probably turn on the music now, huh? Uh. All right. Just saw a fish jump to the left. Hey, BZ have no FP. Not today, man. Not today. We're fishing for big, uh, big fish on Fishing Sim World Pro Tour. We just catch a salmon or a trout, maybe. I think we did. A little trout, a little brown trout, maybe. Get in the boat! Oh my god, seriously, dude. It's called a net. There we go. Wait, when did they add fishing to Call of the Wild? Hey, man, that's what I'm talking about. It's got good good graphics, fairly good graphics anyway. There we go, a little 14-inch uh, pro shed. <laughs> a little brown trout with freckles. I'm, I'm messing up terribly on that. I was using a pro shad with freckles, and we caught a brown trout. Adam Krupp's got to go to work. Hey, take care, Adam. excited as I was for this spot. Oh, there's a big fish on the bottom. A couple of big fish on the bottom now. Xbox controller! Indeed. This game is a pain to play with a mouse and keyboard. Especially if you play in windowed mode. I guess if you played in full screen, it probably wouldn't be that bad. But I play in windowed mode. I play all of my games in windowed mode. Um, so... Difficult. Ooh, right at the end, man. Oh, it's another brown trout, it looks like. Oh, no, it could be a salmon. Look at Coho. There we go, look at that guy, he's pretty. A coho salmon reached level 20 as well. 10 pounder, 25 inches as well, top notch. Hey my dude, what's up Jacob Casey? Well, what lake do you recommend in Fishing Planet? Uh, St. Croix, I love St. Croix, I think it's a fun lake. Hey, is in level 26, fish emerald lake for walleye a lot. What rod setup would you recommend? Um. You're level 26 and you're still fishing at Emerald Lake for a walleye? You need to get a good 12 pounder or, or more, 12 to 17 pound rod and go catch a largemouth bass at the Everglades, man. Start saving up money um, to buy uh, better stuff 
and just get out of Emerald Lake, I guess. <laughs> I can't I can't dawdle too much chatting or else we might lose the tournament. Oh no! Overload! Taz Pertochi, am I saying that correctly? Hello, how are you? That is one of my favorite games. Oh, whoa, well, right on. I like this game as well. I think the trophy fish with the names and everything really make it fun. What game is this? This is Fishing Sim World Pro Tour, man. It is a fun one. Should we cast towards this rock? Maybe there's some hiding. Hiding in these weeds over here. New DLC drops on PS4? Bro, they, it drops at the same time on everything. second place again <clears throat> boy I was fishing at a European lake uh, the other night was absolutely wrecking it so many pike have I played call of the wild yet no if you would have been here earlier you could have voted for hunting or fishing and we could have maybe fi uh, hunted first but everyone uh, lots of people were voting fishing so we started fishing first Do you think they will add upland birds and, and dogs? Here's the thing. When it comes to uh, a game like the Hunter Call of the Wild with uh, developers the way they are, uh, always wanting to make the game better, uh, just ask yourself that question. Would adding X, whatever it may be, make the game better? And if the answer is yes, then, then yes. I mean... Uh, I, I do think that they'll try to put it in the game because they want the game to be better. They want more people to play it. Uh, they want uh, you to enjoy playing it, you know? So uh, so if there's something in the game that's missing and it's going to make the game better, then they'll most likely add it in the future. Can you get the fishing game on PC? Bro, I'm playing it on PC right now. Don't you know? I'm trolling. Don't even mean to be trolling, but I am. Come on, fish. Are your babies in here? Jacob Casey, what you don't know is that uh, I'm actually pretty good friends with the uh, the developer behind Ultimate Hunting. Um, so yeah, he he sent me the trailer this morning to show it to me. Come on, Mondo Fish. Gotta, 
Gotta win this tournament. <laughs> Dude, we're getting behind. We only have eight. There we go. Well, that's a pretty big fish. The way he was pulling, anyway. Oh, it's a little bass. Dang it. Get in your bass. That's a pretty good good sized bass there. A little smallmouth looks like. Not what we're fishing for though. It looks very similar to Hunting Simulator 2. Uh, what I can tell you is that uh, just from the the short talk we had this morning he said that um that they're going to have different ages of animals and so different sizes of animals as well um as you saw the babies in the uh in the game as well uh just to add some more realism to it um he also said that it would have a trophy lodge so that's kind of cool Um, but yeah. You feel awful today and you're angry. Do you think ultimate hunting will be Call of the Wild? Well, here's the thing, guys. There's some people who think that Hunting Simulator 2 is better than the Hunter Call of the Wild. It's not, clearly. Um, so when you talk about a game beating another game, to some people it will, you know? To some people uh, who are interested hunting elephants or, or giraffes or something like that, and they can't do that in the Hunter Call of the Wild, well, then they're going to love a game like um, like Ultimate Hunting or something like that, where they'd be able to do that. Um, you know, it's just whatever you think. And then the graphics weren't the best, and the dogs can do the same thing, which is kind of a deal breaker. Yeah, I mean, and we knew that from the start, right? We 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 knew that, uh, you know, they would spend a little bit of time on it. They would make it look as cool as possible, and then they would abandon it, uh, which is it's pretty much exactly what they did. Um, God, man, I really thought this area would be really good, shallow, for the pike. But it is not. At least they counted that bass towards my score. God dang it. Come on. Jeff Bendix taking off Bryce, isn't it? It's Bryce. All right, take care. Will Ultimate Hunting come to Xbox? I would say any uh, anything that Ultimate Fishing is on, we will most likely see it on on it as well. So if you can go on your Xbox and go to the Microsoft Store and see Ultimate Fishing there. Uh, you'd be best to assume that you'll probably see Ultimate Hunting on there as well. Um, but yeah, I didn't want to do a video over Ultimate Hunting yet, uh, just because all we've seen so far is animals. And so I, I didn't think it was kind of worthy of doing a video. Uh, the people, <laughs> people posting videos over that must be hungry for content or something like that. I'm not sure, but uh, I didn't see a need to post a video about it. 
What is this song we're listening to right now? Gosh dang it, bro. He nail. We need to catch like two more fish. Solidify our lead. We are leading by not very much, man. BZ, how are you doing? Aiden Mitchell, I'm doing great, man. Or uh, Michael, my bad. Sorry, I'm fighting a fish. You know how it is. You gotta stay focused. Super, super... Uh, I don't even... Yeah, super focused, I guess. Ooh, that's a big one. That's a pike. Good deal. This is what we were looking for. Because we are going for length. So big, long pike is definitely going to help us out. Come on, you dirty pike. Tighten the drag up a little bit here. Hey BZ, do you play the Hunter Classic? Uh, yeah. Do you not? Do you not know my history with the Hunter Classic? I, I used to play it a lot, man, but then the Hunter Call of the Wild came out. It, it feels like the opposite. It feels like a lot of people, like, find the Hunter Call of the Wild, and then they're like, oh, there's another game? Oh my god, the Hunter Classic! I'm gonna play that! And then they're like, no, Hunter Classic's way better than Hunter Call of the Wild. Uh, you know, I was the opposite. I started playing the Hunter Classic back in 2012. And then the Hunter Call of the Wild came back, and I was like, finally, a reason to come back. I was so sick of walking around slowly doing... It's like I was in college at the time, and I would only have like an hour or something to play. Um, and the thought of walking around for half an hour to find like one or two animals or, or you know, one animal worthwhile or something like that. Just didn't sound fun to me, dude. Come on, Pike. There we go! Freaking finally, man. Is this a Pike or a Muskie? It is a Muskelunge. Well, how about that? <laughs> 40 inches long, man. That's awesome. Well, that's exactly what we needed for that tournament there, guys. I don't even need to do anything else. I beat the person in second place by basically two times their score. <laughs> you went to Top Golf and Bass Pro today. Well, dang, man. Very nice. ABZ, how's fishing? Fishing is going well. I just won the tournament. So, you know, freaking amazing, man. Jonathan Savington's gonna go. Okay, goodbye. What are you playing on? I'm playing on my uh, my computer, man. Found um, two sparkly fish. I don't know what that means. But hey, good deal. Absolutely destroyed the person in second place. Got $5,000 added on. 200 more followers. Just like that. Boom, boom. And that's, that's it. There's like, there's nothing else to it. it just <laughs> another tournament down. Okay, so I guess we're going to go into the carp fishing since it's only 8 o'clock. I guess that did last a half hour. So we'll do one more tournament and then we'll be done. <clears throat> Need to catch, uh, let's see, light clouds, afternoon, one round, 20 minutes. Yeah, I think we should be good. Let's see. We have, uh, let's see. A blowback rigs right now, 12 watt. 
or 12, number 12 hooks. Banafi, Tutti Fruity, or Banafi, I guess, not Banafi. Presentation float, good deal. That's a sinking one. I think we're good. Let's just get out there and we'll see what we see. What do you think is the best XP farm in Fishing Planet? Whichever one is available to you. You know, it just goes up, you know, so the one that's uh, available to the highest, the highest level one that's available to you, Aiden My Michael. Um, doesn't mean you can't really do anything if it's not. Uh, they said it was cloudy, right? Greetings, everybody, and welcome to the next event on the tour. While the competitors are making their final checks over their tackle, let's take a look at the rules for today's event. Yeah, they're, they're all going to release on the same day, guys. Uh, console PC same day 30th tomorrow if they need a new weapon pack what type of weapon would you want I would want a spear ha <laughs> um, I'm not really sure man yeah a, a predator honestly I have no idea a predator one could be kind of boring let's see where are we feeling that's a fish jumping out in front of us really close We'll just claim this. Alright, I don't know what the bottom looks like, so let's just cast out and we'll just see, I guess. That's silt, okay. Good to know. Once you figure out what the uh, bottom's like, then you can switch up your, um... Oh shoot, it's running. Well, that didn't take long at all, did it? Oh, a carp just jumped in front of it. Joe Riff! I hope I said that correctly. Joe Riff, hey, thank you so much, man. Appreciate it. Cat, I thought this also. What? What? They're supposed to be Jedi. Yes, yeah, so you get the you get the dog for free. You get your first dog for free. You just need to buy the DLC. <laughs> but after that, then the dogs cost uh what is it, 45,000 each? Something like that. 45 or 48. How much do you like the game? I, lo I love the game. I think it's fun. Cat, you're not invisible to me. Archer Yaks Outdoors, you know the rule, man. I remember everyone. Especially those people who ask me if I remember them. I remember them most of all. This is a fat one, man. Get in the net! Dude, how fat is this carp? Good night. Do you recommend getting hunting Hunter Classic 2? What? What are you talking about? 30 pound mirror carp on the band Banafi. My gosh. That's awesome. Freaking killed it. How are we doing? Usually the carp tournaments are freaking hard, man.
Oh, I freaking nailed that, bro. I nailed that. Can we please cast? Goodness gracious. Grab the first rod, he nil. They're going crazy on the Banafi today. And now they just went for the tutti fruity. Certainly plenty of fish. But what's up, man? I'm joining the vids of Fishing Plan and Call of the Wild. Hey, you're right on, S2K. S2K, right on. Just got your first diamond bear today. You were stocked. You're stoked. He's another hunter call of the wild. Uh, he's uh, he's like a simulator playing YouTuber, isn't he? He plays a lot of simulators and uh, in those type of games. I think Call of the Wild is one of them, but he's not necessarily a Call of the Wild YouTuber. Had a new dog. What type of dog would you want? Oh, well, I would say upland birds, but we don't have any upland birds to hunt, so I don't think a upland dog would be very uh, helpful. I think a, a dog like Bjorn would be helpful, uh, a baying dog, something that will run up and uh, bark at a, a moose or a bear or something like that to hold them in place to uh, allow the hunter to get close to them, I think would be a, a cool dog to have in the hunter at this point in time. I don't really need help getting birds, like a waterfowl dog. Because all the birds float to me, or they are just out there in the field, and it's just pretty easy for me to go get them. Dude! A second mirror carbon is better than the first one. This one's still on. Ripping lips, basically, yeah. Luke Strong, what's up? From what I heard from other Hootubers, I think 45k. What are we talking about? What game are we playing? We're playing fishing. Oh, this is a koi. We got our first koi. We're playing fishing sim world pro tour right now. It's a fun game. Fun, uh, fun little fishing game. We got lots of different fish and lots of different variations of the fish. And they also have trophy fish that have names, little fun names. Like, I don't know, the pig or the zapper or biggie. Who, who knows? Mr. Whiskers. So then you can go out and, and uh, specifically find those big fish. Every Thursday, they also share a trophy fish location as well as what, uh, you know, uh, bait and stuff to use as well. So pretty cool. There we go. 20, 21 pound koi. Are we ahead of the competition yet? Yeah, we got 82 pounds and the next person's at 37. Freaking losers. Okay, let's see here. I, I tell you what, I want to try... I haven't been able to get anything on one of these wagglers. And I want to try a waggler. Let's see. What's the biggest? Oh, they don't have any big wagglers. A straight waggler. I don't know what the difference is. Small fish in large quantities. I don't want to catch a small fish. I want to catch a big fish, though. Dumb. Okay, never mind. We're not going to do that. There's a dark matter rig. Big fish. Big fish. $2,000. Okay. We're going to put we're going to put a big old hook on this one. Go for the big fish. You know any good mule deer spots in SRP? You know, honestly, uh, one of my favorite spots is just that eastern area. I've gotten a, uh, a few different... Um, 
a few different good sized mule deer from that eastern. I think it's the easternmost uh, lodge, isn't it? I was wanting a snarky. Did you ask for the billionth time if I hunt or fish in real life? Yes, I do. <laughs> 45,000 for the doggo. Okay. I see a pike swimming by this uh, darn thing. Let's throw out a third one as if uh, we didn't just have trouble getting two in. What time is the dog DLC getting released? I don't know. That's a good question. Big fish! David Probus, hey, thanks, man. Goodness gracious, how are you doing, man? Two mods, two mods in the chat. This is this is nice. When you go hunting for pigs, have a dog that will chase. Yeah, exactly. That could be it. You know, any love the content, keep up the good work. Hey, Lan and Greeno, thanks, man. Appreciate it. Oh, he's pulling, but he's not. Oh, there it hit the top. It's uh, it's just kind of a heavy fish. Not really uh, super. I don't know. I don't know how else to describe him. He's just a heavy fish doing whatever he wants. But he's not really testing the drag too much is what's crazy. Hunting Sima 2 needs is more weapon hold like three and the animals to attack you show you the wind tripods more camps more types of dogs Nice to meet you Wesley Wheeler Nice to meet you as well. Yeah hunting simulator 2 needs a lot of stuff New content in general would be nice Bass fisherman. Hi, how's it going? There answered <laughs> Cat what'd you do today? Did you help out any baby deer? What are those called again? Phones? Are they called phones? That's so silly. Did they know that we would have phones when they named them phones? Silly phones. All your little spots and stuff. It's been like 20 minutes photoshopping classic into a meme. Oh yeah? David, what have you been up to as well? You're, you're just surviving. Okay. I hear you, man. And it's taken two minutes to get this guy in. He better be like a 40 pounder. I love this music. It's really uh, making it seem like I'm having quite a battle here. There we go. Look at that freaking Mondo. He's huge. That is a linear mirror carp. That is amazing. A 59 pounder. That is insane, dude. <laughs> oh my god. 59 pounds, 5 ounces. Yeah, we're definitely going to I think I think we're going to win this tournament, guys. Guys and gals and everything. Did you miss anything, Crystal Paddock? Oh, 142 pounds of fish in this tournament anyway. I think the last one was what, like 156 inches. Oh, we did get one on that big hook though. Oh golly. Do I have to keep reeling this in? I kind of want to reel in the other one. Bo, it's me, Ben. Well, hello, Ben. How are you? Got to go. Hey, take care, Hendry. Oh, crap. I've learned that if you pressure them too much when they're stuck on the rocks, the line will break. Which might just have to be what we do. Because... That guy's not getting... We're not getting that guy. He's stuck in the rocks. <laughs> <clears throat> As a giraffe, you are a giraffe. From now on, Cat is a giraffe. Don't ever let her change her mind. <laughs> it's a balloon with fish characteristics. Exactly right. 
I'm the dog are coming out tomorrow. Oh, thank you, Miles. You've been riding like a madman in school. Phones, you're such a weenie. You're such a weenie. What what are some good spots for some whitetail? I tell you what, uh the lake at the bottom right, not the the most bottom right, but the big one. The big one in the in the center right bottom center right of the map at Layton uh is pretty good. It's where I got two of my well, one wasn't a diamond, but the other one was diamond deer. Yeah, since I'm 13, not 17, so I can't be on until my account gets deleted. Oh, no. Net him. Get in the net. That's a pretty nice little common. Bigger than the one I caught the other day, I guess. <laughs> 25 pounder. That's nice. Hey, someone in the uh, Kansas City Carp Group caught a 27 pounder, though. That's not too bad. Well, we don't need to keep fishing, but we are. I mean, what are we going to do? Wait for five minutes? It's just, just a bunch of silt around here. Forty foot necked leopard camel. Sounds legit to me. That's exactly right. Do we dare? Do we dare? Actually, let's just cast over here. <laughs> Your character. All right, look at this. I'm actually getting a break. I can actually just stand here. Oh, I tell you what I could do though. I could, um, I could throw a spot. So I'm gonna have to hit like 20% or something like that. God dang. I don't know how they did, why they did this. Like, what is the point of having your spod rod cast so much further than your other rods? The tutti frutti! The tutti frutti be taken off! Looks like another leather. The white tail of the ninjas of Call of the Wild. Speed up and be the 16th I want my babies to care for. Aww. That will be fun. You're going to definitely have to take pictures, cat. We want to see pictures. Just got done with the guitar lesson. I'm learning the free bird. You're lear learning free bird. You're learning the free bird. Free bird. Play free bird. Hey, that's awesome, man. Sounds cool. Lukey. Bees happens tomorrow. Bees? Do you like Johnny Cash? Do you like Johnny Cash? Do you like Johnny Cash? Um, yeah, I mean, I used to listen to Johnny Cash, I suppose. Back in, like, high school. Tyler Ramsey's got to go. Hey, take care. That is a marathon of a song. Well done. <laughs> you request attack bees. 27 pounder there. I tell you what, we haven't absolutely destroyed the competition yet, being at 195 pounds when they're at 66. So we better keep fishing. Tactical nuke incoming. AARK, congratulations on your diamond three days ago. Hey, thank you, AARK. Full W. Call of Licking Wild. Let's increase the drag, why don't we? Goodness gracious. Spot rod equals a torpedo. Uh, it equals like a... I don't know. I would say homing missile, but you would think a homing missile would like... 
know where it's supposed to go. This doesn't look like a... This looks like a crucian carp or something, like a giant crucian carp. Or something. What are you? Is it a giant crucian carp? It's a bream. Oh. A 10 pound bream. Why did we struggle with a 10 pound bream for that long? Goodness gracious. I have a friend that claims his cousin works at Expensive Worlds and said Whitetail have a glitch and can't respond. That answers my problems. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we've heard that before. I have a, a friend and he said that his dad is the CEO of Expansive Worlds and um, he said that elephants are coming to the game. So... We have that to look forward to, I guess. Always the same thing, isn't it? <laughs> Tell you what we need, though. We need a heavier line. Maybe. I don't know. What's the heaviest line we can get? 50 pound at $8,000? Jesus Christ, day. That's crazy. We can't buy that. I guess, I guess I'll just have to wait the last two seconds of the tournament. Ugh. <laughs> hey, look at that. We won pretty easily. <laughs> the person in second place getting 66 pounds. That's what I'm saying. Like, every time, every time we have a tournament, those guys must, like, look at the BZ Hub name and just think, Ah, crap. <laughs> that guy's here again. Did you hear... That he caught 195 pounds of carp. The person in second place caught 66. That's it. <laughs> that can chase rabbits. Oh, yeah? What is your biggest fish? Uh, an arapaima. We caught an arapaima at some point. Pretty sure. Let's look. Is it this one? Yeah, look at that. There it is. Arapaima, 336 pounds. Pretty sweet. It's like the music that your kids in your class list, they listen to like movie music. Will you see other people's dogs in the call log? Uh, yes, you will. Only one person, like every one person gets a dog. I'm pretty sure you see their dog. Pretty sure. Oh, yeah, very sassy male. Dogs won't hunt, hunt animals like ever. What babies are you getting? The the phones. She's getting the phones, David. Come on. What are you guys naming your dog? Obviously, Bjorn too. Psh, k, psh, k. Let's uh, let's see. Oh, red tail catfish. I want one of those. There are how many? One, two, three, four, five. Five different trophy Arapaima. Goodness gracious. Bunch of different trophy. Wow, that's crazy. There are so many trophy fish at Lake Travis. I have not caught any trophy fish, as you can see. <laughs> I obviously need to play more. And that's when I'm going to announce that we're only going to play this game from now on. Because <laughs> I need to catch up. Goodness gracious. Here's uh, Gigantica. This is the uh, lake that um, Corda owns. The, the, the carp brand. Orta. Goodness gracious. But yeah, I can see all the different species in this game. There are quite a few. And these are just the ones I have. I'm sure there's more DLCs with more animals or more fish on them, but I guess they're kind of animals, aren't they? 
Yeah, they're really pretty looking fish. If you haven't been able to tell yet, I'm, I'm trying to kill time because we still have six minutes to go before we switch over, but... <clears throat> Are elephants going to be in Call of the Wild? Who's to say, Miles? Not right now, anyway. Don't believe my friend's brother works at... I was just saying he said that. To, it made sense because I can't see Whitetail, but I don't believe him. I, uh, I, I see Whitetail, so I don't know what to tell you, man. Or Hunter. <laughs> I'm back, by the way. I feel rabbit hunting would be a lot, a lot better with a beagle to chase them towards you. Okay. That's a cool name, Cactus. You can see their dog. They have a lot of very handsome bucks or rods. For AI season, the rods from a buck in US. Interesting. What is your biggest fish in real life? Uh, just the other day, beat my PB 15 and a half pound uh, uh, carp, common carp, but uh, should hopefully go up. Uh, I made a lot of friends in the Kansas City carp uh uh group i guess so uh, hopefully they'll uh get me into some larger fish as well as we're going fishing down in florida huh may so uh maybe we'll get something big there too i have caught a bull shark but i don't know how much it weighed we never weighed it so it could have been bigger you know and i've caught bigger fish in my life we've just never weighed them so i couldn't tell you It's Chase. How is everyone? They're all doing well. <laughs> My largest mirror carp. Yeah, we caught in the last session. That was pretty sweet. People have to make a living. Hunting together could see each other's dog. Which of you have eight people and eight dogs all crowding around terrified? <laughs> What's the best way to get XP in the fisherman? Uh, I don't know. I'm assuming it's fairly similar to Fishing Planet and uh just catching big fish man lots and lots of big fish god's outdoorsman do i remember you you know the rule man i remember everyone especially the people who ask me if i remember them um but specifically yes i do remember you um panther is here chase did you film it the the carp oh bro I guess, uh, just in case you weren't here. <laughs> oh, you can hear him talking. Yeah, he's talking. I am like itching to get my first fish of the year. I've been out three times this year. And, oh, uh, shoot. <laughs> guess it helps if I share my screen, huh? <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> oh, you can hear him talking. Yeah, he's talking. I am like itching to get my first fish of the year. I've been out three times this year and uh, just hasn't worked out for me. Go. Let's go, dude. A new PB. Ooh. So, yeah. Um, like I've mentioned before, the trailer for this one will be, um, on the BZ Hub. And then the full video will be on, uh, the new channel for all things outdoors. So look forward to that. I'll make sure to post some stuff once that happens. But, uh, but yeah, I'm pretty excited to see what everyone thinks. The fisherman is the grind, like grind fishing planet. I totally just messed that up. <laughs> Today was 70 degrees and both of your old bikes, dirt bikes were broke. Oh, shoot. Megan is here. What? Megan's here. The whole place. Seth Lathauser, Luthauser? Student? What you miss? You missed all of the turn. We, we did two tournaments in, uh, in Fishing Sim World Pro Tour. And uh, we're just about to switch over to the Hunter Call of the Wild, which I should probably just do that right now. All right, let's go. Gotta get our dog out, everyone. You gotta stretch his legs.
Yeah, I just realized that we're uh we're like forty-five dollars well fifty fifty-five dollars away from meeting our goal. That's awesome. Tell you what, since we're uh since we're here, let's go ahead and um this is the beta. I don't have any spawn points is the is the one problem. But hopefully it won't be that big of a deal. Yeah, today we got like rock music, I guess. Let's not listen to that while we're playing the Hunter Call of the Wild. Do 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 Let's just do Let's do that. All right. Oh, geez. We are way back here. Come on, puppy. You're in two. You're in two. Hey, 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 hey. Get back here. Dude, David Probus. What are you doing, man? That's not what I was trying to say. <laughs> Dude. Thank you so much, man. Goodness gracious. Oh, bro. Did you see did you see the design I sent you, by the way? I I don't know if any everyone knows this, but uh David was one of the winners of the uh, of the t-shirt design way back when, and he wanted a lesser kudu design. And uh it took me forever to make one. But uh, I finally did. <laughs> I finally did, and I sent it to him over the uh, the weekend. But I still don't think he's even seen it. There, I'll show you. Look at that. There we go. A little lesser kudu design going to be added to the uh, to the store, everyone. And David Probus is going to be the first the first one to get it. So hopefully. Hopefully he likes it, man. Goodness gracious. Oh, look at this. It's like the Matrix or something. I don't even know. Okay. David beat me, so now you gotta ban him, okay? <laughs> oh, God. You guys. You guys are killing me. Killing me. Thank you so much, guys. Seriously. Uh, Megan, sorry to throw you in with the guys there, but, but thank you, David, and thank you, Megan. You both are awesome, truly, and uh, can't wait to do more videos. We got the, the new Modern Day Outdoorsman channel going on, of course, and uh, cannot wait to go do some of that stuff. Make more outdoorsy channels. Uh, not channels, but videos. Goodness gracious. That's badass kudu. Thanks, man. All right, Baron. Oh, you're right here. Hi. Press B to interact. Oh, what a good boy. I pet him too. I do like how they added the zoom feature. Back when I was uh, working with the, the beta, um, before this whole thing came out, there was no zoom feature. It was just like a cut to like looking at him. Uh, it was very jarring. Anytime you like did something with the dog, it would just like cut to being right in front of him. Um, and they fixed that and it looks, it looks amazing. I, I think they did such a good job. It reminds me of Far Cry, uh, Primal when you could interact with your pets and that. So much fun. My phone wouldn't scan my face without your glasses. <laughs> I need my glasses. I can't see anything without my glasses. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Even use uh, that is very true, Megan. Yeah, how did you get into that conundrum? I'm I'm confused. I'm I'm curious to see if it was there like a line or was it out of order or did you just wander in? Like thinking, oh, well, the right side is usually for women and then it ended up being for men or something. Like, how'd that go? Is the dogs coming out tomorrow? The dogs are coming out tomorrow. Yes. The dogs are coming out tomorrow. The 30th. Just joined. Is it just me or is anyone really excited about the dogs tomorrow? Dude, I am... I'm certain that there are a lot of people who are very excited about the dogs tomorrow. And I'm excited to see what everyone else thinks of them, for sure. Oh, cat's leaving? Also, too, as well now, Bo. Oh, God. That's true. That is true, though. We could have a Bjorn, too, and an Oslo, too. <laughs> If the hound could be your chore money. Hey, a little $4 uh, DLC is not too bad for for some chore money. I, I think anyway. So I think you run a pretty good chance, man. You have come back with the milk. Okay. Extra shift of the work this week and you are hype. And you are hype. Well, right on. Good deal. Parker, I spent so much time on that game. It is a fun game. I played it uh, twice without beating it, and so I just told myself, I've got to beat it. Let's just, just beat it. And uh, we actually filmed the entire thing, too, so. <laughs> like hours, hours of gameplay. That was in the rough period when I was, uh, when I was working a lot and just trying to survive, basically. I remember those days. <laughs> Not very <sighs> fondly. All right, we're going to actually run to this cabin. We're going to skip the left cabin. Get out of the way. Um, and then we're going to change the time, I think. Samantha Morseman, how's it going? Did you miss anything? Well, you missed all the fishing. We started off fishing this time around. Usually it's hunting. Uh, but a lot of people were there in the beginning asking for fishing, so we did fishing first. I lost the case for them, and I may or may not have taken them out since 2020. Oh my god. My uh, my eyes are killing me. So much so that uh, even without eye insurance, I scheduled <laughs> I scheduled uh, a, an appointment to get my eyes checked again and to get new contacts, because I just need some contacts that hold in moisture better. Goodness gracious. Because uh, I spend so much time in front of a computer... And even when I'm not in front of a computer, my eyes seem to dry out. And it's not good to have your eyes drying out when you're out fishing. <laughs> and you're miles away from your contacts and your home. So, <laughs> especially if I want to do any camping this year or anything like that. Do any videos of that too. So, yeah. It started with, I ate McDonald's. And then I had to go. So, I hurried to the toilet. And then a guy walked in. And I was like, oh, dear God, no. Okay, so really not much to it. It just kind of happened that way, huh? Because <laughs> the door to get in the men's bathroom was too big for my chair. Oh, no. Did someone have to stand outside, David? Or did you just roll in like, yep, this is happening. Don't fight it. I am here now. That doesn't sound like you, but I just thought I'd say it anyway. <laughs> Still don't have the New Zealand map. Well, what the heck, AJ? What are you doing, man? Dogs come out tomorrow. Frick, I hate this extra shift now. <laughs> March 30th. March 30th. So if there was a clue, where do you think it would be? Where would they hide a clue? Hmm. What? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh, you really got behind there. You must have smelled something. Some poo. Some poo or something. Oh, we need to claim this.
I'm more excited for the black box and animals showing up on time to zones. Hey, that is a good point. Maybe we should go look at black bucks. Sorry, I realize we just got here. Here, let's do a quick look about... Um, let's do a quick look about... Um, do, 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 do. We're going to have a quick look about the lake in case there's a diamond whitetail there. And uh, if we don't see anything, then we will move on to Parque Fernando and look at the the True Rex Black Bucks. How about that? Back, that's why I call it the black hole. <laughs> but uh, yeah, thanks for bringing that up, Johnny Crow Bro. Because I kind of forgot about that. I wasn't a big fan of Parque Fernando in the beginning, so like... It didn't really like since we started our new game like I haven't even been to Parque Fernando so yeah <laughs> there's that grind my goal is to beat my PB bass by the end of the year hey right on man I had a guard at the door the restaurant owner told me to use it oh okay good yeah well good because you could have sued him if you did <laughs> I'm sure he was happy that uh he was happy to let you use it. Are dogs coming out on Xbox tomorrow? No. No, but they're coming out on everything but Xbox. Specifically just your area. Strange. I know. I know. Where are you from again? Yeah, that's exactly where it's not coming to. Crazy. Uh, yeah. If you haven't noticed, they've only given us one date, everyone. March 30th. And that's because everything is coming out on that day. Uh, so that's that. Ask the dog for the clue. That makes sense. Where are you? Why do you keep disappearing? Huh? What is wrong with you? Look at me when I talk to you. <laughs> He's adorable. All right, let's keep going. Answers to the colonies homework. I can pay attention to the stream more. Oh my god. Do you know the answers to your colonies homework though? Do you? I love your live streams. Hey, Collins Outdoor Adventures. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. That means a lot. I'm glad. It was a mom and pop's old place in VA. I was just glad the food was good. Oh yeah, that's for sure. That is for sure. Come on, white tail. Where's your white tails? Huh? I thought you started drinking at 12. Show some promptness. Be prompt. JJ Shark, how's it going? On Pennsylvania, dang, bro. Yeah, it's rough. It's a rough life for you, man. <laughs> you are a dang ninja. Squish is a ninja. She's a Canadian ninja train. Don't you know about the Canadian ninja trains? They roll on shurikens. A drinking zone for one black-tailed deer. How about that? That's kind of strange. I don't remember the white, the black-tailed deer being around here. I wonder if they really changed up the need zones. My wind is like blowing straight to where we're going, so we're gonna spray some of this on. And blue or dingus? <laughs> I don't need history, bro. Everyone needs history. If you don't know history, then you're doomed to repeat it. Don't you know? What if there was a historical fact about zookeeping? And if you would have known it, 
then you would have saved that giraffe in the future, huh? Come on. Knowledge is power. The more you know, the more powerful you become. Sorry, I could not make it to the other streams. Hey, John Clay, don't you worry about a man. I don't ask that you show up to all the streams. All I ask is that you live your life to the fullest. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Are you excited about ultimate hunting? Uh, I, I guess. I don't know. Dude, all we've seen are wild boar, red deer, and seeka deer. I, uh, everyone's like going crazy about it. Dude, we haven't seen anything about the game, and this is coming from me. You're a ghost. You are a ghost. Squish is so pretty. Aww. Is this stream haunted? Um, oh, we could only be so lucky is, is what I'm trying to say. Dude, I don't know. There's like nothing around this lake. This lake is usually hopping with activity. And I don't mean the rabbit that we just found. Pillar <laughs> Cactus has got to go. Hey, take care, man. Did you take your cuckoo medicine? Did you take your cuckoo medicine? I see ducks. You try to show up at all the streams. Hey, you're right on, Chase. I, you know, I'm glad. Something ran by here. We have not seen... A single deer this entire time. They just couldn't. Making progress for a better life. Hey, right on. That is, that is really cool, Megan. You can do it. Wear more gauges, smoke less cigarettes. That's what I'm that's why I'm off. I'm gonna start making motivational posters about that. Smoke less cigarettes, buy more gauges. <laughs> Megan took her her medicine. See another track for black tail deer, man. Okay, this is worthless. We're gonna move on. You talking about me? You talking about me? <laughs> M4 Wold, how's it going? NKR Fishing Now Doors, hi. Oh, knows me so well. Exactly. Yes, I do. Okay. So, where should we go to find Black Buck? I don't even know the Black Buck's uh, drinking time and eating time. Does anyone, anyone know? No one knows, I bet. Gosh, why doesn't anyone know this? We're going to do that. We're also going to take a super loud four-wheeler all the way over there. We're going to see how well Bjorn 2 can keep up. Bjorn 2! Okay. Let's go, Bjorn 2! Nine thirty to twelve o'clock. We just did eight thirty though. Trying to watch and do homework at the same time. Ooh, ooh, dang! I've been coming to the stream for eight months now. My name is Chase. Change it to it's Chase. Ooh. Yeah, I've always respected you more since you changed it to It's Chase. It's just punchier. It's like you're just, you just push yourself through the door and you just, you know, people aren't going, 
hey, what's your name? And then you say, oh, it's Chase Belson. No, it's it's Chase. You know, you have you have no say about who I am. I am Chase, because that's what I said. So, yeah. All right, we're getting out here. I would walk 500 miles and I would walk 500 more to find a diamond black buck around these parts. <laughs> well, how do you feel that the hay added a bull shark to fishing plant? I think it's really cool. I think it shows that they are interested in making more saltwater fish, dare I say. Um, cause I know a lot of people are looking forward to a saltwater fishing. So, uh, yeah, maybe we have more saltwater fish to look forward to in the future, everyone. You know? I mean, eh, I guess that's not true. I was gonna say, you would think about how they made blue crab, which is kind of a saltwater place. Brackish water, anyway. And then they added, uh, then they added this with the bull shark, but they did have a few different South American maps in between. So, yeah, not really that way. You can wait for the black buck. Oh, yeah, yeah. We can all wait. Yeah, show some patience, everyone. Jeez. <laughs> you want this dog? He's pretty cool. Though he doesn't follow you very good. Where are you? There you are. Hi. <laughs> I wasn't mad at you at all. But I am mad that I can't find any animals. Tokyo drifting on your quad. I was gonna find an animal and start doing donuts around it, but the animals are so hard to find right now that I guess I won't do that. Jeez. You think two weeks left? Two weeks left until you can buy the DLC? I got a diamond wild beast. Dang, man. Oh, there's a deer there. He's in the ground. Not really. When will the new map come out for the fishermen? Hard to say. Uh, maybe in a, in a month or so. Yeah, it, it's honestly hard to say when anything will come out for the fishermen. Uh, the fishermen was kind of just a cash grab uh, to, to get money from people. And, um, uh, of course they said yes to it, because, yeah, why not? So, what can you say? I, I think, I, I just keep thinking to myself, you know, if Fishing Planet lowered the price on their DLCs, I bet they would sell a lot more of them. But, unfortunately, they, they're all at, like, $20 and $30 and more. Just so expensive. Like, it's it's kind of ridiculous. I would never spend that much on a DLC. Or never uh, recommend it to someone. Even I mean, it would have to be, gosh darn, really good. How many dog fur types are there? What, is there like six? Is there six? I'm not sure. I got confused just looking at them, so... <laughs> I've been out of the loop late. Only thing I've been looking at is Microsoft Word. Oh gosh, that is true. You have been doing a lot of, a lot of writing. Hey, there's some red deer. The small red deer stag over there. Oh, we got some, some axis deer. There's a piebald axis deer as well. Piebald, however you want to pronounce it. There might be some black buck over here though, so we'll have to keep an eye out for that. But for now, there's another stag. There's a pretty decent sized axis over there. Watching all the axis run. That's a pretty decent sized one too. Right on, right on. So we found Axis, we found some red deer. Found a dog. A dog. Let's keep looking. Axis deer tracks. Oh, 
Wildebeest are your favorite animals to hunt, eh? Megan's going to sleep. Because you have work in the morning, you gotta go shower. Ugh, adult things, what the heck? What's your dog's name? It's Bjorn too. Obviously. Some people prefer the fisherman because it's less grindy. Uh, yeah. Yeah, instead of grinding, you just have to wait literal months for them to put out the new DLCs. <laughs> Less grindy, though. More red deer. Can't really see them. It's so dark. There's a, a level seven stag, I'm assuming. Ah. Now I see them. Bunch of axis deer. Oh shoot. Spring break now. My family's going to Kentucky. Also, I might go catfishing and try to catch some trout, too. Hey, right on, man. That sounds awesome. I hate self-evil part of the fiscal year. Uh, Self-eval. My bad. <laughs> Self-eval part of the fiscal year. Uh, yeah, are you going to grade yourself pretty hard? Or uh, how, what, do you, what are you thinking, Squish? Lost the, I lost the deer. Where the frick did they go? Uh, there they are. Well, that one's not too shabby. We're in the water now. How about that? <laughs> My wind is going right to them. They are just freaking... Ooh, that's a big one. Let's get that guy. Look up, please. Look up, please. A dumb deer. Did not smell me at all. I know I had that spray on, but seriously, I was like 50 yards away. Rohanga needs elephants. Imagine walking around and then an elephant just goes like, yeah, cut G and got launches you. Um, yeah, unfortunately, I feel like uh, having African elephants in, in Rohanga would be more like, oh, hey, look, there's a giant elephant right there. And there's another giant elephant and another giant elephant. And I'm just going to shoot all of them because it would be super easy. Yeah, nice little, nice little uh, deer there. 183.6 making his way up. We were that close to a hard shot. Goodness gracious. Literally just needed two more inches of penetration. That's okay, though. What is your PB smallmouth bass? Yours is five pounds, 20 ounces. I, I don't know, Weston. If we're talking real life, I mean, I'll probably haven't ever caught a smallmouth bass. To be honest. I don't think I have anyway. This little red deer over there.
Trevor Wood, how's it going? Yep, it's unknown, man. I don't know when the dogs are coming out. They never seem to tell us exact times. Uh, so answer questions for don't actually apply to my job, oh, because they are geared towards accountants, lawyers, and not little administrative girls like you. Oh, so they just ask you, like, what is your favorite color? Squish answered green. Last year, it was orange. <gasps> She's changed. This is not good. This is not good for the company. We must let her go. Only 16 ounce and a pound. Yeah, yeah, he just, you know, he meant, he meant that it was another pound on top of the pound, you know? Come on. Jeez, five pounds, 20 ounces, just six pounds, four ounces. He was just testing us, okay? God, why you gotta be like that? Hey, come here. Come find this blood. I don't know where it is. Who asked us to play without tracks? Jeez Louise. Oh, here he is. <laughs> yeah, good job, Jern 2. You found him. 189.8.8. Okay. Yeah, wow, he's wacky. He had one good antler and one like a tree limb. All right, all right, all right. Well, let's go grab this cabin real quick. <laughs> um. Can we see the king and prince at the end of the lovely stream? Hey, maybe. Yeah. Only because of David, though. David and Squish and Megan. See you over there. I see you running, see you rolling, they hating, try to catch me riding nerdy. Shot and the elephant would be worse because you would get vaporized and lose a diamond. How have you impacted our business model society? Be specific. I sign literally everything that comes to my desk. Don't care about your club. <laughs> Sticking it to the higher ups. I like your style. Whoa, dilute. Deer. Another deer. Wow, there's so many deer over here. Who knew? Darren, too. Did you see these deer? You didn't say anything. Are you trying to watch me lose all of them? Oh, that one's pretty big, actually. Let's go look at this guy. He had tall antlers, anyway. Come on. Press X to doubt. <laughs> had a bayonet on it. <laughs> oh god Brant blood is in the house how's it going Brant how long do you think this stream will be at the same time as every other stream main all right Bjorn two time to shine brother Track this blood wherever it be. There it is. Not very good blood, but you know what? Track it. Track it, Bjorn. Track it. Keep going. Don't lose them. Go, Bjorn 2, go! Where did they go? Come on, they went this way. 
Thank goodness I am the one with the eyes because you did not see them go this way. When is Fishing Planet? There is no Fishing Planet. Didn't you read the title today, Team Ock? I don't know if you guys know this, but usually in the, either in the title or the description, I say what games we're playing. And uh, if you if you've been to the stream before, then you know that we uh, we play a game from 7:30 to 8:30, and then we play a game from 8:30 to 9:30. So um, if it's 9:05, we're in our second game, and we are going to be switching to another game. That's the way the cookie crumbles. Come on, Bjorn. You have all the DLCs for this? Hey, you're right on, man. You're in the all DLC party like me. Are these red deer or they're axis deer? Okay. Level up! Wow, good job, brother! <laughs> brother! Goodness gracious. Okay, I need you to track again. I have no idea where these dudes went. This tracker skill went up! Oh, he's going over the hill. Oh, are you or where are you going, bro? Okay, we're going this way now. One of my classmates was bullying a kindergartner. We are in six. We broke his arm. What? Jesus, dude. That's messed up. Did you get arrested? <laughs> Good golly. duck one i'm just refusing to get it at this point you know until they fix the ducks it's just the duck one's just really not that useful other than the guns i find the the semi-auto shotguns kind of fun sometimes <laughs> people will never read in general a mythical what Bro, that's like one away from a diamond. Eat lead, kitty cat. All right. What do you think the chances are that we'll find a black bug over here? I think we need to go back to the main lodge area and uh, head down to this lake, maybe. Mule deer handlers look like old TV antennas. <laughs> that muley back black buck. Muley buck. Golly. And mad jukes. I agree. You're in, this is your time to shine. It's around here somewhere, man. Go find the kitty cat. Your dog. You find cats like they're like they're going out of style. Come on. Oh, it went this way because of this super bright red blood over here. Oh, hey, look, a kitty cat. Bark. Waiting on you. Any day now. Oh, he's growling at it. That's funny. <laughs> 37.9 there. All right. Top notch. Let's look for a black buck. Let's look for a black buck. There's a ring over there. <clears throat> meat 224. Hello, hello. How are y'all doing? How's it going, Meat? Big Mac, what's up? I like the duck one. If you like six setups, you can easily kill 90 ducks in like one to two hours. Yeah. I just like the, uh, I like the way the ducks were in Hunter Classic, and I don't know why they changed it. 
It's like they did geese and the geese were like the hunter classic and they were fine other than them being a little infrequent sometimes which I understand is frustrating the geese are fine and then all of a sudden they were like you know what for ducks let's not do that I know it's like the tried and true way that we usually do things and allows people to set up the blind they just bought the DLC for but instead let's make it so that the ducks die and then they repopulate somewhere else it's like, why? Why would you do that? Just made the game less fun. Ducks are boring. I mean, if you have enough of them, they're pretty fun. But they're, yeah, they're just... They're infrequent. They're just un infrequent. But they are. There is nothing over there. That's cool. All right, let's go this way. We're going to go check out some uh, some lakes. Raphael, how's it going? That cat saw a cucumber. Do you think the dog level up symbol will change so it isn't the money symbol? It isn't the money symbol, it's a dog. Where we are uh, two levels away from level 10, too. Stonehenge. Will this DLC be on Steam? Uh, yeah. Yep. The frick was that? You doing? Can't walk when you're in front of me, silly goober. The geese here, map. I'm even in the good spots. Well, what the heck? Sounds like they do. Oh, I'd have to agree with you then. All right, you black bucks. Where the frick are you? Eight, nine years, and they're still holding on strong. We'll ride on. Yeah, I'm not sure what you're talking about. When it when it says level up, it's uh it's like a dog icon. Maybe if it pops up again, we'll be able to see again. Did you miss more info I missed about the dog since last time? Probably not, man. We're just playing with the dog. We don't have the tracks on. We're just kind of playing around. What are you? Pretty decent sized mule deer over there. We're looking for black buck. I was hoping they would be around this uh, this lake over here, but nothing so far. Do you play with fans? Uh, we used to have a community day every once in a while. Um, but haven't done one of those in a while. I think just because we haven't played the Hunter Call of the Wild in a long time. We play it very infrequently now. Do 
That is true, David. Yeah, we open up a friend's room on, uh... There's a buck. Open up a friend's room on Fishing Planet every Wednesday. Depending upon where we're, we're uh, fishing. Come join. Well, there's one mule deer. We're looking for black bucks, though. I think we, like, I, that was the original plan. We just need to run towards this lake over here. There's a kitty cat. All right, black bucks, get ready to meet me. Comes out tomorrow. any thoughts any thoughts about ultimate hunting uh it has wild boar it has seek a deer not seek a deer axis deer um it has uh, a red deer that's all we know it shows an elephant in the picture but we haven't seen anything about it we know that they have a trophy lodge and that they're gonna have uh, different aged animals and that's all we've got so not a lot to go off of we'll have to wait for more information i do know that uh my uh i don't know if i'd call him a friend but the guy i i know the developer i guess of the game said that um it's coming out in 2022 so got a full year before it's going to come out so a lot of time to learn more about the game and potentially be hyped about it It will most likely come out somewhere between 4 a.m. and 11 a.m., I would assume. Not red deer, elk. I would assume they're red deer. Do we need to watch it again? They could, I guess they could have been elk. I'm not sure. Hello, everybody. We are back. Jesus. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, so there's a wild boar, there's an elk, there's an axis deer. That's what we got. I guess I didn't show it, did I? Gosh dang it. <laughs> Here, we'll watch it together. So I should say that the developer is from Poland. So uh, the wild boar, he actually sent me a picture of a wild boar that he had hunted. Um, so that was pretty cool. He knows a thing or two about wild boar hunting. As well as red deer and roe deer. There's an axis deer. So there we go. Elk, axis deer, and wild boar, eh? Coming soon in 2022. <laughs> yep. Top notch. Congrats on the kayak. Hey, thanks, Holix. It's all because of uh, David Probus and Megan. 
My goodness gracious, I'm so excited. Get out and go do some some stuff now. I'm gonna have to feel like I'm gonna have to get another GoPro. <laughs> get another waterproof camera that I can bring out with me. I don't understand why my I can't do anything on a moderator level. It's either I block someone or I get, or I report them and I don't have any options to time people out. Shark cage videos, Bo. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I want to do. That's what the next, the next one will be. Saving up for a shark cage video. <laughs> Guest bridges. Hey, thank you so much, Big Mark. How much is the dog deal? See, it's gonna be four dollars, I think. Three ninety nine. Remember when you said you wanted a girlfriend? You got one. Well, dang, man. Bike life, bike life. We just saw something running down there. What was it? Another mule deer. I'm so sick of these mule deer. Go away, bro. So many mule deer and so few black buck. Probably needed to go further, uh, further south to these lakes, but <clears throat> what can you do? Just got the pike slasher on fishing planet, man. Big Mac, good job. That's awesome. I think I called you Big Mark first. Sorry. <laughs> You should do skydiving and then volcano jumping. I'm not going to do skydiving. No one can talk me into doing skydiving. It's it's simply, yeah. I'm not just going to put my life on the line like that. <laughs> I have way too many things that I want to do in my life to put it in jeopardy doing skydiving. Stupid. Another nice four. Yeah, that was a nice size mule deer. I'll, I'll give it that. I'll give it that. But I don't want mule deer. I want black buck. Let's go across this land bridge. Seven minutes left. Fox Day and my friend's accident claimed it instead of taking a screenshot. Well, losers. In the night with your older brother. Well, that stinks, maybe, Simon Spangler. I'll go skydiving with you both. <laughs> no, thank you. Comrade Doge in the house. Christy Downey Beach Beachel? Is it Be Beachel? Am I saying that correctly? Right on. Good deal. How are you? One drink zone for a black buck. Let's go. Don't know where he is, but he's around here, boys. It's a female. What the heck? Hey, black buck. Black buck. We found them. 
Stupid trees. Get out of the way. Like the last time I'd be able to. Well, dang, bro. I, you know, I'll tell you this. Uh, I'm married. And my brother. Uh, he sleeps in my house every night. So, not the end of the world. <laughs> What was one of my favorite memories from my childhood? Oh gosh, I don't know. Good question. <laughs> I don't I don't know. Uh thinking back. I can only like think about stories from my childhood. We uh we tell the same stories they seem to get to get told over and over and over again. Like, uh, the time that Zachary and I were riding bikes and, uh, and he crashed his bike in front of me, but it was so fast that I didn't have time to react. So I just rode my bike over top of him. It's not like a favorite childhood memory by any means, but I remember it. I don't, <laughs> um, but yeah. Why did Robin Hood drop out of the archery contest? Uh, cause he decided that contests, uh, weren't his thing anymore. Got home from school and did you miss fishing? You did, man. Did indeed. There they are over there. That's a three. That's a pretty good looking three. Hey, look at that guy. That's a four. Nice. So we get a, a pretty good look at the uh, different black buck there. Two threes. Dogs are released tomorrow, Squish Flint. Throwing the facts. So yeah, that's a four, and that is a freaking mule deer. Get out of here, mule deer. I'm so sick of you. All right, let's get some black bucks already. Oh, you be out. <sighs> I am an animal. <laughs> oh, my God. That was a strange view right there. All right, let's take a look at these black bucks. Found it in arrowing, arrowing. My goodness gracious. What time will the doggos release tomorrow? Good question. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty cool, right? Those are some pretty cool horns. I think anyway. Get the other black buck in the background. Jeez. I wonder what bumped me. <laughs> All right, so there's a four. So you can see horn length overall spread circumference at the base, circumference quarter, uh, half, uh, three quarters, and at the top. So very interesting. Pretty pretty similar all the way around, eh? Circumference eight. Said, what is, what is that? Centimeters? What would that be in? Centimeters? I'm assuming centimeters. <laughs> Interesting. So that's 106. So he is exactly a gold. Wow. They get much bigger than that. Went fishing the other day and caught a monster bass. Hey, right on, man. Well done. This is a three. Uh, wow, he was a lot thicker at the base, which is really interesting. Than that last one, 99.4. Shot him in the butt twice. 
And this guy. Sticker at the base as well. So that four that we shot was just really, um, he was just really tall and skinny, basically. <clears throat> Let's go get this guy. And then that might be the yet, the, the end, everyone. Try Buck Fecta. Yeah, try Black Buck Fecta. Oh, 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 oh. Better end it on a high note. Do your thing, Bjorn 2. I wonder where he would have gone. He's, uh, <gasps> you found him. Good job, buddy. He says, I cannot believe you made me track this dude. <laughs> we got him. Oh, man. Shot too far in front on that last one. That's it, everyone. Do you have any tips? Uh, yeah, you'll have to message me on Discord or something. Uh, that's that's going to be it for this one, everyone. Showing off the dog, showing off some black bucks, showing off uh, Fishing Sim World Pro Tour tournaments. Um, yeah, all pretty fun. Obviously, the, the dog DLC drops out tomorrow, so look forward to that. And um, not much more than that, everyone. Just get, get, get that going. <clears throat> what does the dog do? It tracks things. Tracks blood. Tracks, uh... Tracks, tracks. <laughs> what about the Prince of the King? Ah! I don't know where they are. Let me see. We'll see who I can find. found the biggest the biggest dog in the <laughs> you say hi to everyone huh say hi to everyone what do you think what is that thing huh what is that thing oh this is that bright light it's so bright i don't like it <laughs> can you look at the camera huh can you look at the camera? Can you? Say hi to everyone. Say hi everyone. <laughs> You're a good boy, aren't you? You a good boy. <laughs> yeah. Should we take you back to mom? Alright. Okay everyone. Well, Hopefully you enjoyed it. <laughs> Here's our ginormous. Yeah. <laughs> he's adorable. I know. The, well, you know, he's my brother. I can't say too much. But, you know, the dog's pretty adorable as well. I agree. <laughs> I'll make sure that, you know, like, my brother knows you said that, Hot Rod Dave. Uh, <laughs> anyway, that's it, everyone. Take care. Uh, we'll see you on Wednesday for some Fishing Planet, hopefully. We do have something special on Wednesday as well, so look forward to that. Um, I'm pretty excited about it. We'll keep you guessing about what it is, though. So, that's it. Take care, everyone. We'll see ya, and as always, remember, everyone. <laughs>